Happening today and all summer, basically, uh, we've been kind of showing you those fun places and activities to do across our community. And one in particular has everything from go karts to axe throwing, karaoke, a uh, fabulous lounge to add to it. Yeah, at high caliber. It's really cool. And Rochelle is there right now, and she's getting her hands on every single riding <laughs> game that they have available. Rochelle, how's it going out there? Guys, it is going great, and you know, I had to start with go-karting, okay? This has to be my favorite, and I'm here with Zach, who is the general manager, and he's going to give me a crash course here on the road, literally on the road before we get started, <laughs> and mind you, there are multiple lanes here, okay? So there's plenty of fun for everyone, but Zach, first tell us, what is the big draw about go-karts for somebody who hasn't done it before? So first of all, we have our fully electric go-karts. They are so fast, they're so quick, but also extremely safe. We have the barrier that goes over all the way around the cart, okay. keeps people safe, and then we also have some of the top of the line barriers uh, that keep people safe while they're out there as well. Which is great because somebody oh. like myself, you know, I like to get a Man. little excited. I might get a little too excited on the go-kart, <laughs> but we wanna make sure that we're having safe at the, the same time, exactly. which is great. So continue, tell oh, me more about it. So we have multiple different styles of go-karting here. Mm -hmm. uh, the first thing we're gonna start off is with our standard go-kart. Okay. We can take kids as young as eight years years old on these okay. go-karts alone uh, because we have junior racing that is from eight years old all the way up to 15 years old. Um, as long as you are 54 inches tall, okay. you can race in one of these bad boys because we have booster seats, pedal oh, extenders. Okay. Even booster seats mm -hmm. too. Yep, they make it so that those kids can get closer to the pedals and experience those faster junior speeds okay. compared to our mini kart speeds. But the one thing that I do really, really love about our blue track is we have a thing called combat karting. So combat karting is on your steering wheel, you have a firing button and then you have a shield button, then you have this heads up display. So as you're going around the track you can actually have a weapon that pops up on your uh, your heads up display you can shoot the go-kart that's in front of you with a laser so it's like get yeah out. Wait, so, I you have know, not seen that oh before. yeah and so okay. we have this receiver on the back so when you shoot the go-kart that's in front of you and you hit their go-kart will glow red and it will physically slow down Wow. What's okay, the best part? So you guys definitely do not, this is not your average mm -hmm. type of go-kart. No, we actually developed this in-house. So we are super okay. excited to be the first place in the world to have this technology because we have a great staff that has put this together. They started from the ground and worked their way up. Uh, but we also have that shield button as well. So like if you get in front of somebody, you can feel them coming up. You throw that uh, shield up, your uh, car will go blue and it will deflect all the like shots that come your way away. Wow. And then also it gives you a four second boost to be able to pull away from them. How amazing. So it's clearly not just a drive around the course, but there's a lot more here. But we have to move on over to the smaller one because if you don't hit that 54 yeah. inch uh, requirement, we do have something for yep. you, right? Yep. So we actually brought these on just this past April. Okay. So these are still new and we are so excited about these because there are so many kids that want to, want to be able to race. They want to be able to race. And so yeah. it doesn't matter if you're 54 inches. As long as you're five years old, you can race this. And the best part is, as long as you're an adult and you want to race with your kid, if you can fit into the cart, we'll let you go out there with your kid to be able to have a good time in the mini cart. Which is one of the best things I really love here about High Calibrate is that it's not just a place for adults. It's oh, not yeah. just a place for those grownups. But you can bring the kids here, too. And you don't have to worry about watching them too, too carefully because we're safe while oh, we're doing this. 100% Plus, we've safe. got something for everyone of all different ages yes. and sizes. And the smiles are so great. I know. I so got one great. Right now. <laughs> and now I want to talk about the handicapped, H handy capable cart. Handy capable cart. So talking about that accessibility that we have yeah. something for all different ages, but yep. for people even with disabilities. Can yes. you tell me about this? Uh, so uh, way back uh, about two years ago, the president of our company he actually got into a uh, severe motorcycle accident. He hurt his wow. hip, but it made it so that we recognize people. All people should be able to race go-karts, no matter if you have the capabilities of moving your legs or not. And so what we brought on was this handy capable cart where you have your accelerator right here, okay. and then you have your brake right here, and it makes it so you can do everything with your hands. And we do have a harness that we have inside of our garage that if you cannot even get yourself over into the cart, we can actually drop you down into the cart so that you can go and race with your friends. How amazing. So yeah. again, it's not just for the not just for people who are taller, people who are smaller, but even everybody who has uh, different capabilities exactly. and abilities as well. Yes. How amazing. So now on top of that, you guys have two different tracks. We because do. there's clearly a lot of fun in here. We have the red track and the blue one. Tell us a little bit about that. Uh, so the red track has uh, longer straightaways. Uh, the blue track is a little bit more tight and technical. Mm -hmm. uh, it's it all depends on what your, what your skill base is, what you want to be able to get into. A lot of people really enjoy this because they like to try to get those carts up as fast as they can. Okay. Over here, if you're more of a technical base racer with the blue track, like I said, it's got tighter turns, and that's also okay. where up our combat karting and our uh, mini car races as well. Okay, uh, I think the, I want to try that combat uh, racing over here. So that, actually, guys, I think I want to get started. Uh, Zach, I'm going to need your help, though. Okay, okay. okay. Uh, I'm going to need a little bit of help. Yeah, but uh, guys, absolutely. hopefully I'll be done with this by the time uh, we're back from commercial break. 
But in the meantime, I think I'm gonna get going. Okay. I'll see you guys. Yeah, go ahead. Just, just. Yeah, get into uh, it. There we go. Get that pit speed. See you guys in just a minute.